What's up, everybody, and welcome back to the Two Chaku Podcast. As always, we are your hosts, Xavier and Alton. Like us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, follow us on Instagram, TikTok, Twitter. Join the Discord and don't forget to pick up something for yourself in that Teespring merch store. All links are in the description boxes down below. Other than that, welcome back. Yeah, welcome back, guys. Yeah. So what's going my, up, man? Um, other than the leukemia, nothing. <laughs> no, okay. Man, one of these days, what? one of us is going to have some sort of serious condition, and that's oh. how we're going to be... T- that's how we're yep. going to tell the other. Oh, 100%. <laughs> and you're going to be like, that's hilarious. So what's actually been up? No, I mean, you know, I'm serious. <laughs> Diagnosed this week. It's been awful. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Man, why didn't you tell me? I, you know. Slip my mind. Yeah. You know, one thing came to another. Well, see, what happened was I got diagnosed, got depressed, then I got ice cream, so I wasn't that sad anymore. Went home, started reading some manga, watching some anime, completely forgot. <laughs> Sad thing is, that will legit happen, though. Oh, 100%. <laughs> Dang, I could just, see that. <laughs> got super sidetracked. Just, just got busy, you know? Hey, uh, sometimes it happens. Sometimes you just get busy. Yeah. You know, now, the one thing, though, is I, uh, I raised up this uh, camcorder. So that I can more easily bring it out and put it in whenever I do a video with the other camera. But now since it's so high, it's always going to look like I'm not looking at it. Because I'm going to be looking at you on the screen and it's always going to be looking like I'm looking hey, so far away. <laughs> you shouldn't have done that. Hey. You done now. Well, you know, it's, it's one or the other. That's how it be sometimes. It's one or the other, and I chose uh, I chose the other simplicity of life. So you know, is what it is. Other than that, I got that pizza. You know what's crazy? I'm eating pizza tonight too, man. Are you? Oh yeah. man! Listen, the things we're in sync about. So <laughs> stupid. <laughs> hey, man. My stomach's blowing up. Same here, dog. <laughs> <Dee. laughs> like, ah! <laughs> like, yo, what? <laughs> it's hilarious because it's true. It's hundred percent true. It is so dumb. <laughs> it's like, oh well. You oh, you do? wash your hair tonight too? Me too, man. <laughs> Me oh, cool. too. You got soap in your eye? <laughs> yup. <laughs> Same here, dog. Same here. Oh, yeah. Ridiculous. Different sides of the same coin. Yep. Other than that, World Baseball Classic is on. So no one cares about that. Been watching that. Well, I I'll start another K drama. Oh, you think people care about that? And not oh. the World Baseball Classic? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> oh, okay. I don't even Just know what baseball that. is. Oh. <laughs> okay. I don't even know what sports are. So you know it's a sport. <laughs> nope. That was a lucky guess. <laughs> uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, so that's on. Got to see Puerto Rico uh, kick Nicaragua's butt. So that was nice. So I'm assuming that's like the World Cup, but for baseball? Yeah. Mm. Since there's no, you know, there's no Olympics. There's no... Uh, world competition so MLB made the world baseball classic like uh 15 years ago maybe no probably like 20 years ago or something there's only been a handful because they're like every four years like the world cup you know interesting but they had to delay it because covid so they had to push it back and so it's 2023 but you know obviously it's not as big except like it's huge all over the world except for the United States, right? So, like, one crazy statistic I heard was uh, in Japan, 50% of the population is watching the World Baseball Classic. 50%. In the United States, it's like 13% watch the Super Bowl, and that's our biggest 
TV anything. Like I feel like people are just falling out of love with sports. I guess. They're they're yeah. It kind of feels like that, which is weird because they're better than ever. Like, are they though? Not yeah. really. for maybe certain sports, but not for a lot of these. I can't really watch NFL no more because a lot of it I feel like is just too many. It's penalties entertainment. And stuff. It's entertainment at this point. Well, I mean, it's uh, always been entertainment, but like it's yeah. like reality TV entertainment where it's like it seems like it's scripted most of the time because oh. you're like. <laughs> It's done all season, so this big. team did not score past 14 points, and all of a sudden in the Super Bowl, you're out here scoring yeah, man. 42 points. <laughs> you're out here scoring 138 points. Just, I don't think we're talking about the same sport anymore. <laughs> nah, so that's going on. I'll stick I'll, to my I'll sports anime. Thank you oh, very okay. much. All right. See, I think that's that's the actual issue, but okay. <laughs> Is it? Is it bad? Is it bad to love the storylines? <laughs> okay. So yeah, got myself a Puerto Rico hat. No one cares about Puerto Rico, man. I mean, I care about Puerto Rico. Oh, do you? <laughs> you All know? of a sudden, you care about Puerto Rico. Where just, are you doing the just, hurricane, huh? Just, Sitting what? at home, <laughs> just, all comfy. <laughs> was I supposed to be on the island during the hurricane? Yep. Should have bunkered down with your people. <laughs> what? <laughs> Dang, hurricane coming. Got to catch that flight to the island. You should have fought the hurricane. I've been from Florida. You should have fought the hurricane off. You should have taught them our ways in Help Florida. <laughs> Just but no, what'd you do? Wild man at the highest point of the Puerto Rican rainforest <laughs> screaming into the, into the hurricane. Get out of here, you punk! <laughs> hurricane it takes an abrupt turn back towards the Bahamas. Just like, <laughs> he did it. Just, wow. Second headline: Florida man destroys the Bahamas by sitting a hurricane towards them. Right. <laughs> hey, it is what it is. You know. <laughs> Hey, by the world now. <laughs> wow. What is if you knew you had that power, why didn't you do something with it before? I didn't know. <laughs> Taking where a shot you, in the dark. Where were you doing, Katrina? <laughs> All right, I man. don't know. 11? Just like, it's not an excuse. Middle school? I don't, <laughs> probably I don't know. math class. Yeah, probably. Man, how long was Katrina ago? That's, I think Katrina was what, like, 2002 was it really i think so hurricane katrina i know bush was still president oh five oh five oh five uh i was in fifth grade yeah not even middle school (laughs) (laughs) nah i was i was like oh dang (laughs) that sucks hurricane (laughs) used to it here in florida yep I was like, what's wrong with you guys? You can't. <laughs> Come on. Like, real talk, though, which is the craziest thing. The fact that Florida is underwater, it gets hit by so many hurricanes, and we're just, like, shrugging them off. <laughs> like, hey. What is going on? <laughs> I, I I won't be surprised when Florida's, like, completely submerged at one point. Oh, no, 100%. It's going to be wiped off. We're going to be down to 49 states because Florida is going to be the first to get wiped off. Either Florida or California. Yeah. (laughs) One of us is getting wiped off first. Yeah. The thing is, I wonder how California is going to go because it's an inevitability. It's it's, either going to be a crazy earthquake that just rips it straight into the ocean. Sunk into the sea. Or it's going to burn. It's going to literally just burn. True. If it floods, though, it basically, like, half the state disappears, too. Mm -hmm. So it's like, one of these things is going to happen. Either all the icebergs are going to melt, and half California is gone. And it's, it's like, the crazy part of California, too, you know? (laughs) So, pluses and minuses, but... (laughs) Oh, okay. (laughs) Earthquake happens, everybody's gone. Y'all toast, like... Uh, but hey, I mean, maybe Puerto Rico gets that 50th star. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> maybe get that state stamp. You know? Come 
boy, I'm rooting for you, Puerto Rico. <laughs> just like, oh, okay, man. The United States, like, well, we can't go back. <laughs> <laughs> Puerto Rico, eh? Eh? Okay, <laughs> Fine. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Here's your state tax. This no! is not as bad. <laughs> Not as bad as the regular Puerto Rico tax, so okay. Bro, I'm moving to Take Hawaii. It. Oh, we're talking about places getting destroyed, and you say I'm moving to Hawaii. Okay. Hey, I'm going to be there when that volcano erupts, baby. <sighs> How would you? Okay. I know this is completely crazy. If you had to pick a natural disaster that you had to die in, which one do you pick? Like, <laughs> I, I'm, I'm taking volcano, man. You take. I feel volcano? like that'd be the. It, well, okay, it, it depends. It could be. If, if yeah. I if I go volcano, are we talking like aftermath volcano? Like I survived the eruption, or are you right. talking like I'm on the like mountain of the volcano and like the lava well, spewing out? Well, you're obviously not on the mountain. <laughs> <laughs> you're not looking down like I'm ready. <laughs> take me now, like no. Nah. It would have to be like you're at home. I don't know, volcano warning system goes on. I don't even know if that's necessary, <laughs> but like... Volcano warning system. Oh, okay, man. <laughs> What's the warning system? You hear the kaboom! <laughs> <laughs> like that, you know what I'm saying? Natural, then nah, I'm not going volcano. Because, I mean... Like, oh, so, my Oof. thing is, is like, well, it, okay, in my hearing, like... Yeah, there's just no chance. Like, you guys just gotta sit on the island. There's no evacuation. Like, there's nothing... Yeah, and I just gotta die. wait until yeah, gonna, yeah. the lava takes me. <laughs> you're you're 100 percent gonna die. No, like, I, I'm not, not gonna do that. I want something quick and easy. Yeah. So let's go tornado. Tornado. Mm. I think I'd have to go earthquake. Just get crushed real quick. Yeah, but like, what if it's just your legs that got crushed? Oh, that would. <laughs> that would I mean, knowing my luck, that would that would be what it is, and that would suck. <laughs> or you get a albedo, that, and you get just half your body crushed by a, <laughs> a boulder. God, no. I wouldn't mind going out on a landslide either. Like if I'm just driving my car and know. all of a sudden a landslide hits. As long as it like insta kills you, because here's my thing: it's got to insta kill. Because if it's not like that's why I'm like tornado. I don't know. Because if I get swept up and I'm just like. <laughs> You know, you know, get impaled into a tree. Yeah, uh, <laughs> just get thrown to the ground, and I'm like, oh, <laughs> why? <laughs> I'd rather not deal with that. You know, yeah. If it's volcano, you want to get like hit by everything at once, so it's just instant. Yeah. You're gone. You know, you're donezo. Not I, taking flood. Never go with no, flood. No, absolutely never, not, ever, bro. ever. Because. Never. If you're talking flood in Florida, bro, the the prospects of there being an alligator somewhere. Oh my gosh, bro. No. <laughs> Field day. You're already drowning. Now you're getting eaten. <laughs> you got a python I, I wrapped around wanna, your butt. I would like, never want to die by drowning, bro. That's no. 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 The pain. Uh, drowning and being burned alive. The two Yeah, no. Don't don't sign me up for those. The cra here's the saddest part is that burning alive faster. You going faster? Are you though? Yeah. How long you think you can hold your breath? Because here's the thing: you're gonna hold your breath, you know, and then you're gonna. I got a good like, thirty seconds. <laughs> oh crap! I've been holding for two minutes. This sucks, you know. Yeah, you're but which fire. one's you're more going. painful though? That's my thing. I feel like drowning's more painful mm, because drowning after a certain point, you don't feel anything when you start burning. Like yeah, after a certain feel, point, yeah. Once once your your, you your nerves nothing. get burned out, it's like all yeah, right, that's cool. It. I could just chill now. <laughs> I, I dope. <laughs> Did he just crack his knuckles while on fire? Yep. <laughs> just I ain't gotta feel nothing else. Ain't feeling nothing. Surprisingly not dying though. <laughs> but like drowning, bro. Like you yeah, ever tried no. to hold your breath as long as you could and it's yep. just like that's painful. On top yep. of that, you're gonna just like your body your body's just gonna naturally just try to yeah, hold start. its breath. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Naturally Until start. it eventually you have to take in that air. Yep. And then, and then you're still gonna be drowning. Yep. That, that, well, yep. that's the actual process of drowning. <laughs> that's that's when the drowning yeah, you're just actually taking starts. Taking the water. Yeah. That's when the <laughs> yeah. That's when the drowning starts. When you start taking in the water. No. 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 I'd never choose drowning, especially because I've already had pneumonia. Had a few times. A few, I've drowned man, how enough do you get in my pneumonia life. Pneumonia a few times. You get it three times, bro. That's how. <laughs> the 
I've never had it. <laughs> you get it. You get it thrice. <laughs> Let me tell you, man. I've drowned enough. Oh, okay. I have drowned enough. Last time I had it, bro, I was just sitting there, and I had already. I didn't feel good. I but it felt like you know, kind of like fever. And then every time I breathed, it started feeling like I was getting stabbed in the lung, and I was like, hmm. <laughs> this isn't normal. So I t- I t- Probably go to the doctor. I told my dad, and he was like, yep, we're going to urgent care. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> and they were like, uh, yep, that's, uh, that's pneumonia for you. <laughs> and I was like, oh, okay, cool. All I'm thinking is, how much time am I getting off of school, though? <laughs> oh, okay. Got a week off. <laughs> Got a week off because I was almost dead. <laughs> yeah, you know, you had to make up all that work though. Actually, I didn't. Here's the thing. Here's what here's what kids need to understand. If you get into the good graces of your teachers, a lot of them, if you're out for like time with like something real, they'll let you skirt by. Unless you miss like a test or a quiz or something, they're gonna be like, "Don't worry about it." They don't even count the grade. That's what they did for me, and I was like, appreciate it. Especially because, you know, you, my, my mom was probably like, yeah, my mom was like, uh, he's dying. And they're like, ooh. <laughs> ooh. Keep dying. this kid come back to three different assignments? That's why I couldn't what be a teacher. We? I'd be like, I don't care. That's life. What? I'm, gonna teach, I'm here to teach your, stu- uh, teach your kids about life lessons, and this is one of them. The world doesn't stop because you're dying. So neither <laughs> Meanwhile, does my class. you get sick, hire a sub. <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> what, you ain't going to teach while you're sick? No, dog, I'm sick. <laughs> I'm taking two weeks off, man. What are you talking about? I'm taking my time. <laughs> what? That's how it is. Yeah, that's exactly how it is. I remember, bro, there was this one girl. She got a... Uh... Oh, my gosh. What is, what is it called? Uh, oh my gosh! You you could get it mono. She got mono. Hmm. She got mono so bad. She was out for like a month. Jeez. And then it like I don't. It led to like something else. She dropped out of school. Her parents took her out of the school. That's how sick she got. I was like, yo, that's that was crazy. Could you imagine? No. I, I bro, I. Mm. <clears throat> I think the like sickest I've ever gotten to the point where like I had to miss school was, I think it was like middle school. I had like, I think I had like a stomach bug, mm-hmm. a fever, <laughs> and it was coming out of both ends. And I was like, I called my mom. I was like, "Listen, Look. lady, <laughs> <laughs> Look. I ain't, I ain't playing." I gotta come home. You got me. I'm dying. (laughs) Bro, I remember I had to go to the bathroom, and the teacher was like, only one person can go to the bathroom at a time, and somebody was already out. And I was like, ma'am, if I do not go right now, (laughs) they're gonna be dookie everywhere. (laughs) This this class, you're gonna have to evacuate the classroom. (laughs) I never sprinted so fast to a bathroom, bro. I was hitting like at least a four flat down the hall, <laughs> flying. <laughs> oh man! I had to go to the bathroom. I knew it was gonna be unoccupied, which was in the gym. So smart, smart. Almost died, bro. I went to the office. If you got to like, poop in school. You know it's a problem. Yeah. Oh, a hundred percent. You know, a hundred percent. Unless you that weird kid that's just like, I'll poop anywhere. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> Why are you doing that? Yo, I'm not going to lie. Those people scare me. Those yeah. People, they, if freaks. I ever walk care. into a public restroom and somebody's just in there just dropping a deuce, I, I yeah. immediately Like leave. it's nothing. Like here's the thing. I get it if you're like you're at work. You don't you don't have another option. But like those. Hey, yo, hold it until <laughs> you get home. People, That's your option. Those people at Disney and like Universal and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> people flatline those toilets. <laughs> And I'm like, go back to your hotel, buddy. Like, <laughs> no, nah, you got a, a day to go back pass, to. bro. You ain't got a like, day pass. Bro, I mean, like I said, unless it's an emergency where it's like, yeah, I ain't making it back. But yeah, it's bro, bro it better be an if emergency. If I can wait, best believe I'm waiting. Oh, 
100%. I just I on top of it, I just like to be comfortable, bro. I don't want to be yeah. like freaking hovering be, over the yeah, toilet because nope. you, if you think I'm sitting on a public toilet, nope. And then you got to put the eighteen pieces of those like <laughs> those, if they those, have like <laughs> if they have the things. the little toilet, you know. <laughs> and it's like oh, if not, you I gotta try to layer toilet paper paper across you, it. You don't want the water to touch your wee wee. It's like. <laughs> It's like so many things. <laughs> it's just no. It's, it's a no for you, dog. It's oh my gosh. Nah. It, no. Nah. That's why I'm like, it, leave me constipated, ladies. Bro. I don't know how you do it because you gotta sit down every time. They gotta hover. And, and I, bro, you ever tried to hover? Nope. <laughs> Look, I'm be honest. You no. you find out. You, that's the day you find out whether or not you have strength. Right. <laughs> Let me tell you, bro. It's here's the problem. Also, it's like every the problem with going to a public bathroom in the United States is the toilets, mm-hmm. right? It, and the toilets are the problem because if you go to a public bathroom in Japan and it's like a modern place, you know that toilet's clean because it cleans itself. You go to a public toilet in the United States, you don't know the last time that sucker's been clean. That's true. <laughs> You don't know. I mean, most of them they look disgusting to begin with. Oh yeah, you don't know what kind of booty bacteria is trying to crawl into you, like. <laughs> Bro, I remember no, no. when I used to um, no. work at um, uh, no, no, this no, no, catering no. spot. Uh, I used to deliver to um, like, you know, corporate buildings and yeah. business suites and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Some of the best bathrooms I've ever been in. Oh yeah, hundred percent. I I will blow Keep those bathrooms those up. Because yep. I knew they yep. were clean. They had cleaning yep. services that would come through and clean them. So I was like, yep. oh. Like three times bro, a day, baby. There was, there was like multiple spots I knew. If I was ever driving around in Tampa mm-hmm. and like Florida, I'm like, and I, I mm-hmm. bro, I had an emergency. Mm-hmm. Whipping it into this Whoop. business suite. I don't even belong in here. Nope. <laughs> I'm not meant to be unless here, guys. They had, unless they had a security, bro. like security, like checkpoint you had to go through. Yep. I'm in there, bro. Yep, I'm in there, <laughs> busting it out. Like this is what I've told people: you want to know the hookup, go to hotels. Mm-hmm. If you if you got an emergency, you got a drop trout, go to a hotel. Yeah. Why? Because that public lobby bathroom is gonna be ten thousand times cleaner than ninety percent of the bathrooms around you because mm-hmm. they need it to be clean. It's gotta it look has clean. To be clean. It's dude. gotta be inviting. It has, it, it has so, to be clean, bro. I never went into a hotel and went to the lobby bathroom and seen. Nope, you have never seen it, bro. Nope. When I worked at the hotel, the Marriott, mm-hmm. bro, I used to run in there all the time to use the bathroom. Yep, yep, bro. That's the secret. That's, that's the hookup. The that's the hookup. I don't like. Now, now you might be scared. Be like, oh, what if they say something? No, you just gotta look like nothing. you belong. Yeah, just, they're not gonna just say act nothing. like you already. You know, just hey, how you doing? Yeah. Take a glance at the front desk. Maybe you don't. You just go straight to the bathroom. Yeah. No, you just keep walk past the lobby. Yep. They, they're just not going to be like, do you have bathroom. a room here, sir? That I yeah, no. That's Unless not, you look suspicious. It's not something that they can really do either. Because they might be like, oh, okay. Maybe they're meeting someone. Maybe they mm-hmm. do have a room here. They don't know everybody who checks in. They're not mm-hmm. going to remember. Simple as that. You go in. You act like you're supposed to be there. Take a dump. Walk right back. <laughs> they're probably like... What? <laughs> hey, business. Yeah, I had to take care I of some business. I had to, I had, oh, I forgot something in my room. I gotta go yeah. back to work. Yep, had to had to pick something. Plus, what, what are they gonna they do? Know. Did you just come in here I and take a dump? It. <laughs> yeah, it's too late. Like, I already done did it, S- sir. <laughs> Call the cops, sir. You I'm can't come and poop dog. in here. Is this a public bathroom or not? Like, <laughs> it's a public bathroom for guests. Okay, well. Maybe next time I'll go across the street to the other, to the, your competitor. <laughs> I'll take my business elsewhere. <laughs> like, oh, okay. The best is, bro, this is why I said, like, if you're at Disney, they don't ask no questions. Too many people. Too many rooms. Just slide in, slide right out. Mm-hmm. Can't tell you how many times I've done that. Oh, I okay. <laughs> I don't even know, dog. It's like, it's... It's genius. 
<laughs> this is about to, this, this is about genius. to contact you, bro. Charge right? people all the time, all the years you've been blowing here's, up here's their hotel the, here's, bathrooms. Here's all the poopage fees. You think I'm gonna poop in that park, bro? <laughs> no. You walk into a Disney bathroom and it is disgusting, bro. Like, see, I would have thought that Disney kept their bathrooms clean. You would have thought. Too many people. Too many kids. What they really need is they need like a bathroom attendant in every bathroom all day long. But they're not gonna do that. No. They're not gonna do that. So you walk in, you have all these little kids getting water all over the floor, you know. Oh. Pee everywhere, I, you know. Go ahead and slip one good time. They'll they, I bet you they'll they'll fix it every, then. Oh, a hundred percent. Hundred percent. But still, all of it can be avoided. Y'all just need to buy the Japanese toilets that clean themselves. Man, they ain't buying no Japanese toilets. They should. But they're well, not. We know but they, they should, should, but they're not. They clean Companies they clean don't like the spending inside. money, bro. Bro, they clean the inside, they clean the outside. I don't remember if it was you that sent me the video or or I just saw it. There's the Japanese toilet. It's got like a plastic ring around it that it just comes out. Whenever someone new is ready to use it, then it gets sucked into the toilet after your business. New one just gets churned right out. I'm like, yeah, that's that's it right there. <laughs> that's it, baby. You got some with UV cleaning. You got some that uh, like steam clean themselves, bro. Like, listen, dog. Uh, <sighs> or you know, you just get rid of toilets altogether. You just. <laughs> Japanese style I mean, squat that's toilet. An that's Everybody's an hovering. Everybody's butts hovering. No, no tushies on the seat. Cause man, some people but like some I said gross. that. Yeah, well, you think you can hover until yeah. you start hovering. Until you <laughs> denting and like the thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, like, don't try oh to God. hold on to the walls either, bro. No. Your hand's going to slip, and it's all downhill from there. <laughs> Trust me when I say this. <laughs> all downhill. <laughs> Man, why Why do you know that? Just just trust me, dog. Don't worry about it, okay? Just trust me, dog. All I'm saying is you probably don't want poop back inside your underpants. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, don't want that. Don't want that. But yeah, so yeah, you know, major props to the ladies, um, because y'all, I, I, I don't know what y'all have to deal with in those bathrooms, but that's probably not as bad. I am thankful for, sure. for urinals. Yeah, I don't even like going in a stall to to, to pee sometimes because I'm like, no, it's pee. disgusting. Dudes don't know how to flush toilets. Which like flush it with your foot, dog. Like, oh, flush it easy, with your foot, bro. Easy. I don't, if you don't want to touch the handle, I get it. I yeah I totally Use get your it. Foot. Kick it, kick that sucker. Get it. <laughs> <Ha -bye. laughs> I bro, <clears throat> how nasty. Ugh. I'm not and even gonna get into it. it, but yeah, no, it's just ugh. it's just nasty. Be better, man. way. Be better. Get us better bathrooms, please. For <laughs> love of God, for the love of God. I know you think we're all savages, but like. It's probably also because none of the guys' bathrooms have been renovated since, like, the 80s. So, like, <laughs> your grandpa, like, yeah, I pooped there, too. And it's like, see, that's the problem. That's, that's the problem. <laughs> Be better. Yeah. Either way, uh, wasn't expecting to talk about that, but, you know. Nice, light little episode about pooping for you. So. <laughs> Pooping behaviors. So, uh, I said, like, it's, oh god, it's so stupid. Like, it's on Facebook. Subscribe to us on YouTube. Follow us on Instagram, uh, TikTok, and Twitter. Join the Discord, and don't forget to pick up something for yourself in that Teespring merch store. Uh, Mandalorian reviews on YouTube. Uh, if you're wondering why we're not talking about that, it's because Alton doesn't watch The Mandalorian as of yet. So, uh, been a little busy. Yeah, and uh, next week or week after, I think it's a, the week. Not to be week yeah. after. Yeah, I can tell you right now, after. I'm not gonna be caught up next week. Okay, so week after, 
<laughs> anime reviews uh, for winter. Mm-hmm. Yeah, winter 2023 anime season reviews. And uh, yeah, see all of you in the next one. Until next time, guys. <laughs>